Chairside Radio. Well, what is that? Essentially, it's a radio designed to sit next to your easy chair. The dial faces backwards so that while you're sitting in your chair looking towards it, you can see what's going on. This particular chairside radio was made in 1946, right after World War II. Not quite as fancy as the ones that were made before the war. This radio is in 100% original, unrestored condition. Nothing's been done except vacuum the dust and cobwebs out of it, and it works great. This radio is AM, FM, with two different FM bands, shortwave, and a phonograph. There were two different FM bands. In 1948, it changed from the 50 megahertz range to the roughly 100 megahertz range that we have right now. This radio was built in a transition period, so it could actually do both of them. And of course, it has one of the coolest things on any of the radios that I own. The little push button on the front of the radio will cause a record player to rise out of the front of the radio. This is also controlled from push button switches that are up on the top of the console. I love it. This radio uses the Zenith Cobra tone arm. And on this particular one, as you can see, there are two tone arms. The green one is for LP 33 and a third. The black one is for the older 78 RPM records. This also has an automatic record changer, but the automatic record changer only works for the 78 RPM records. I'd like to demonstrate the automatic record changer for you. See if you don't think it's pretty cool too. Thank you. 